Hi, and welcome to Meals, Munchies, and More. Today I'm going to renew my cutting boards. I've been neglecting them for some time, and I have some deep cuts, scratches, and are starting to absorb odors. It's not particularly nice to cut up fruit on a board that smells like onions. This one is bamboo. When I drip some water on it, you could see how it just soaks up the moisture. The other one is wood and has a weird coating on it that's starting to flake off. It's been less than five minutes and the bamboo board has completely soaked up the water I dripped on it. So let's get started. I've already disinfected my sink, so first I'm going to take care of the odor issue by using something that you probably already have in your house. Lemons and salt. Squeeze lemon juice over your board. Then sprinkle salt generously on it. I use the lemon half as a sponge and scrub down the board. And now, instead of rinsing it off right away, I'm going to leave this paste on the board and dry it in the sun. I do this with my other cutting board as well. Deodorize with a lemon salt scrub and let it dry in the sun. Now that the paste has hardened, I'll bring them inside and rinse them off. I find it easier to scrub off the salt mixture with some water and a spatula. And then I do the other side of both boards. After the boards are deodorized, and completely dry, it's time to sand them down with an 80 grit sandpaper and then 120. After that, you can use a 220 or 240 grit sandpaper to give them a nice and smooth finish.
I probably could have sanded this down more to get rid of the burn mark, but it doesn't bother me. This is what they look like sanded and wiped down, and now the last step is oiling the boards. Food quality mineral oil or linseed oil is what I would recommend. If you use something like olive oil, it can become rancid and all your hard work will be for nothing. I oiled the bamboo board four times and the wood board six times. It takes a few days to do this, but in the end, the results are so worth it. From now on, I'll oil my cutting boards about once a month to keep them water repellent and looking nice. Thanks for watching and I hope this video helped you. Make sure to subscribe if you like this video so you can join me next time. Bye!